I know charging stations, they can look a little intimidating, especially if you're used to a gasoline run car and filling up at the tank, but that's what Drive Electric Week is all about, making this look a little bit more approachable. We're smack dab in the middle of this uh, national week-long celebration of, pl of plug-in vehicles. It's meant to raise awareness of the availability and benefits of all electric and hybrid cars, trucks, bikes, and more. Governor Scott announced a $2.4 million grant program this week aimed at installing more EV charging stations around the state. Another event this week is at Burlington Electric Department showcasing more than 30 EVs with opportunities to ask the owners questions. Well, we think it's important that we begin to transition the, the transportation sector off of fossil fuels and moving to electric is one key and important way to do that. And of course, here at BED, we're especially sort of um, encouraged and excited um, to move folks to electric in part because of the incentive that we offer on electric vehicles. BED offers basically a $1,200 rebate to people who buy electric cars. Enthusiasts also note that EVs cost less in maintenance and in powering the car. It's been found that it costs an equivalent of spending about $1.50 for a gallon of gas. There's also the obvious environmental benefits of burning less fossil fuels and contributing less to greenhouse gases. So that's all there. Again, the event to learn all about uh, EVs and charging stations and everything, that's on Saturday from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. here at Burlington Electric Department. Live in Burlington, Jackie Pascal. NBC5 News.